like I'm just super excited because this is Coach Pillow Tabby, which broke the internet and everybody here on YouTube got crazy about this beautiful bag. So I bought two. This is the first one that I bought. Um, and I got it in a very nice, decent sale. Anyways, yeah, let's go ahead and um, I'm gonna let you know about my thoughts on this bag. And oh my god, it's... Oh my god, it's right there already. Oh, you know that I love pink. I usually go for the very light pinks, nude pinks, muted pink. But yeah, this is a really pop of color in your buzz, girl. Pink. <laughs> More of like a salmon pink for me, actually. Oh my gosh, here it is. And I would finally, like, it's such a good feel it because we do not have any coach store here in um, in my city in Gothenburg, Sweden. And there is not a single store that has coach. Not really. Not even on our like super high end store and co. They don't have this one. Oh, I don't know. I don't even know why. So that's that. Um, that's the return label for this parcel. Let's like put this down for now. And oh my gosh, this is it. Ooh. Okay, I must admit, this is not sparking 100% life to me, but it's sparking joy. So like sparks joy sparks life <laughs> so this is how it looks oh, oh my gosh this is really really super squishy oh my god i could sleep in this bag wow now i understand what everybody is really talking about because oh it's a pillow anyway and i, I really think that oh, okay that's like a stress reliever especially that i i work in a very like fast-paced environment and there's like a lot of uh, things going on and stress and at the end of the day I just wanted to uh, hug something and I could hug this bag if I'm wearing it to work. All right first off so for this part of the video I lost the audio but I was just talking about the magnetic closure it's a very good magnet and then in the inside of the bag we can see some compartments here a zipped part in the middle and there is also the coach dust bag in white this a very nice one and um, I was also talking about this one. I see the story patch. And I was um, reading that too. Few people may see it. But it will always be a reminder of our commitment to quality and craftsmanship. And I could really say that this story patch is a very nice coach leather. So that is really super cool. Alright, so there was like a coach thing in there. Made in Vietnam, it says right there. Alright, so we have this brass detailing, which is really, really nice. I really appreciate that. It looks like very well made. I love that. And this doesn't really scream coach all over your face. There's just like a, a C here, yes, which is the exact same material as the entire bag um, and then here on the magnetic closure there is a tiny coach right there I don't know if you could see that there's like right there and on the sides you could see oh, the lobster clasp and then on this side we have the coach tag right here and then this one says yeah like the code and all that it says pillow tabby and we have this super big squishy bag tag. So cool. This coach in New York in there. And then we have uh, two straps here or handles. So one is this shoulder strap that you could of course use as okay, that is a very comfy. Like it's very nice supported here. So if your bag gets heavy, it's gonna be like very, very comfy here. And then you could also use it as a crossbody, that which I mention every single time I make a bag video. The good thing about this is that when you are done with your day and you are like tired from work and all that, you can just use it as a crossbody. And then you can use your hands to do whatever you need to do. Like you can go shopping, um, groceries, and like 
go to any stores you can carry shopping bags here and there grab things here and there and um, use your phone whatever so hands-free I really like that I really like options on bag not just like being a handbag or just being a shoulder bag and of course you could also use it like one shoulder right here if you wanted to look at like a messenger bag um, and then yeah that's really really nice of course you can also like use it at the, to, at the crook of your hand like so or crook of your arm just like that very pretty I love it but this is the, the real question. Am I going to keep the pink or am I going to keep the black? And the black will be on the next unboxing. It, it will be together with my uh, Michael Kors Soho bag, the studded bag in orange, which is going to be perfect for summer. You know what? I really like this one. This is so perfect with my white shirt. And this is always the reason why I wanted to have a white shirt every time I do unboxing because it really would show and reveal the color of the bag and like yeah complements the bag so okay that's gonna be so difficult to decide but so from my previous unboxing i did unbox this aldo bag which i plan to use today at work if you wanted to know my thoughts you should check out that video but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and um borrow the stuff that i have in here on this aldo bag so we could see what fits inside this coach yellow tabby in the large size so there are my stuff my makeup bag which holds my life <laughs> from putting in my makeup and then also for the to call it um, removing the makeup um, mirror compact it has it's my contour palette my airpods and my card holder are here so those are the essentials that i bring to work every single day so you are going here for a bit and the display right there and then i'm going to check which ones we could fit in this one all right so we open it once again and then all right let me try it on first i am going to put this one and I think that there's really a lot of room in this bag and I'll be able to fit all of my stuff so this is just like a little bit higher than, than this bag or nah I could I could push it in it's a pillow bag anyway so I was able to push in um, my makeup bag and then I could put my airpods right beside it so it looks like that and then I could put compact mirror for the contour palette on the other compartment the wallet i could also put right there on the side or it could even be like standing like so and then um if i wanted to change from my contact lens to my eyeglasses or bring sunglasses for the cover for it then i could even squish this in here because there's some room for it she's good for work is there and yeah okay it will be a little bit bulky but i think just the case would would fit in there anyway so i'm just gonna put my uh I know. so there as you see those are the stuff and then where did i put my phone there so the phone of course so for the smaller bags i wasn't able to put my phone inside but i think it would fit in here should I just choose between my eyeglasses and this one? Um, otherwise, I could try to put this in the middle, right here, in the zip compartment. So, iPhone 12 Pro Max. And yeah, squish that in there. So now, I have a super full <laughs> right there. And let's see if it's going to close, because I'm not sure. This is like so full. I have to remove this one. I have to remove that if I wanted my phone to be in there. And so, and we can close it. All right, so I chose my phone <laughs> and not my eyeglasses. A little bit of folding in there. 
So you have to make sure that you really choose the stuff that you're going to put in here. But this is quite heavy right now. And oh my gosh, now that it's full, we can that this is still very, very nice and soft. So that's about it. And I really also plan to buy um, like another squishy bag which I saw even before Coach Tabby was out and I think it was Pinko. Pinko, that brand, have some, uh, they call it puff or love puff bags and I am going to see which one is like much more squishy and much more pillow-ish type of bag. So yeah, I'm gonna order one of those very soon. Hopefully, I haven't decided on which color yet. So I'm gonna put here on the screen which ones I have my eyes on but if you wanted to also adjust the strap here you have everything um so it was defaulted to the shortest and if you were a tall girl then you can like of course adjust it depending on your height and your preference so um i'm not really sure yet if i'm going to keep this color because i haven't seen the black yet and i'm telling myself that i should just keep one so I'm going to let you know <laughs> and or you have to stay tuned for the next and video. Check out all of my bag videos. I have quite a lot here. Victoria's Secret. I have lots of uh, Michael Kors, uh, Marc Jacobs, Kate Spade, Aldo, and much more contemporary brands. So there you have it, everybody. Thank you so much for joining me in this video. I hope that you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed unboxing and um, checking out this bag and uh, checking which one fits in this bag also from my daily essentials and i will see you on my next video remember to stay fierce fly high and